countless hands, about 800 people, all in the name of Christmas. St. Peter's Catholic Church hosted its 29th annual Christmas dinner today, and the coordinator, Robert Keeter, couldn't be more excited. So from 29 years ago until 2014, here we are, making this, this, this building and this church their home on Christmas morning. A line of people wrapped around the church as volunteers joined together to prepare ham, turkey, mashed potatoes, green beans, salad, rolls, and assorted desserts. As they walked in, each were handed a ticket. Once they were done eating, the giving did not stop there. Wool t-shirts and sweat, you know, woody, hoodie sweatshirts, thermal underwear, socks, gloves, toiletry bags, a gym bag. We buy all this stuff. All of these things handed out to the people in a duffel bag after they finished their meal and toys given to children. Robert Keeter says although it's a huge blessing, there's one thing that saddens him. When you've got about 2,000 homeless people on the streets of Columbia, that's a lot of help you got to give. And the fact that we still have to do that in 2015, it just breaks my heart. It really, really does. Despite the ongoing issue of homelessness and poverty, today is a reminder that everyone is loved, no matter what. It makes me feel good inside that somebody cares, really. It's been rough, it's been rough for me during that my time. And um, I care about people, you know, but I'm glad. It seems like to me I'm getting it back and I feel very comfortable with it. And today was another success for St. Peter's. With full stomachs, warm clothes, and smiling faces. I'm Destiny Chance, and I'm here with the volunteers at St. Peter's, and we're wishing you a Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas!